What's going on everyone? Welcome back to another episode of Ending Magica 2 Expert Unofficial and today is going to be all about blood magic. So we need to get into it because we need to make it for a celestial altar so that we can craft the starlight infuser so that we can craft the master infusion crystal so we can get into missile agriculture and not be bogged down by constantly recrafting all those infusion crystals. So, to get into Blood Magic, we have to get into this gate over here, which means we need a Rudimentary Snare, which means we need Mana Steel, which I'm sure we have plenty of. One, two, three, four. We need Redstone Roots, which I'm pretty sure we have the stuff for. And then we need Enchanted Fabric, which needs String and Wool. So let's grab... We need one, two, three, four... And then let's just grab a stack because I'm too lazy to count that out. Okay, and boom, boom, boom. Now we have four enchanted fabric. And we should be able to craft one of these bad boys. Alright. So, that should give us living rock and blank slates. Cool. Uh, so let's open up. Thumbcraft, because we got the Enchanted Fabric. Uh, I probably won't go down that road, unless... Oh, it gives a discount, so we'll definitely go down the road um, once we get there. It's really... I have Goggles of Revealing. Here, there. Um, goggles of Revealing done. Thaumaturge. How easy is it to craft? Oh, it's pretty easy to craft, actually. So I might do that later. I'm getting sidetracked. Um, we need to bust into blood magic because now we can claim this. I've begun the quest line. Awesome. So we need the rudimentary throw at a monster and then kill them to obtain demonic will. Okay. Oh, it's sunset. Perfect timing for once when I actually want it to be nighttime. Uh, do I need this? I'm just gonna combine it just in case I don't have it. Um, put that in there. There you go. Let's go outside and start throwing this at people. We know how the mobs like to spawn. Look at them all already. Anyone want to spawn over here? I'll just kill you guys. That's fine. Oh, there's people all over. Who wants to die first? You. Do I get demonic will? Wait, do I, have to, do I have to kill throw the monster and then kill them to obtain okay? So then I kill you? I'm so confused. Why are you not dropping? Am I doing something wrong here? Alright, what if I do this and then I Oh, I can't miss. That's So it doesn't do any damage okay so i guess it's just okay y'all are annoying me okay let's try you okay so it seems to be like those modded zombies it doesn't like um so you gotta be i missed i'm gonna make some more of those because i think we need more but there's like a good little quality not sure all right so i went around grabbing some more demonic uh, blood? Is this all the monocle I have? I guess so. Well, alright. So if we got demonic will, we can claim this. Not that it matters. The blood altar is the main crashing mechanic of blood magic. It infuses life essence, blood into items, transform them. The tier 6 altar, although not implemented yet, is 20. If it's not implemented, why are you telling me? So you should make plenty of room when preparing to build it. It gets bigger with each tier. You can use Spectre to visualize. Sure. Um, okay. Uh, claim. Hellfire Forge. So we're going to need a block of mana steel, some stardust, some quartz silver, and some arcane stone. So let's get this. We have... Some stone, some crystal, 
Now we got a stack of that. We need alchemical brass, which I don't think I have on me or in the system. So let's see here. There we go. Here's one. Two quartz silvers. Stardust. And mana steel. Let's get out of here. Uh, we should have some star metal. Let's make one. You probably smelt down. I'm going to grab you out real quick. And then mana steel. So we need some... Oh, I guess I have enough flux to start getting <laughs> those uh, warp things. All right, so let's... Did I see a quest complete? I just wasn't paying attention. All right, so let's grab all of this. Got a nice full mana pool. Go back home, because I don't want to deal with that skeleton right now. And we should be able to make a... Hellfire Forge. Bada bing, bada boom. The false kind decided that this is gonna be our magic area. That's not Thomcraft. So our little forge guy is gonna go here. And I have no idea how to use it. Okay, I see sanguine sci scientium for details. Sure. Arcane ashes. So if we do demonic will, white, coal, gunpowder. So I think this goes there. I'm gonna have to do some reading, aren't I? It's doing something. I think it's crafting. Okay, so it did work. Now we have arcane ashes. Hurrah. Um, I think we need to get into a sacrificial dagger. We need to go this way. I'm pretty sure. Surprise, surprise, I haven't really used blood magic before. So we're just gonna need... I guess more ender pearls. I love that we have so much, uh, so many ender pearls now. Let's grab that. Let's grab some glass. Let's just make the whole thing. There we go, mana pearl, arcane ash. We need this, which means we need a living twig, which means boom, which means bam. I don't know if this is a quest. I don't know what that soul scrub even is for. Now we need to go home. Again, make a trip into here. Might as well just grab all the brass out of here. We don't have much though. So we will need to make more. So there's our brass sacrificial dagger. All right, apparently there's nothing to it. I just need to craft the actual blood altar itself, um, which kind of seems like a little bit of a pain. But let's see, the blood altar, what do, I, what do I not have? Demonic will, I have it. Glass lens, there it is. <laughs> Already coming back. So I need one, two, three, four. Uh, let's... Book markets, aquamarine. Let's see here. Silver. Glass pane. Oh my. Boom, boom. Bam. Um, I know we need more silver, so I'm just gonna grab some. Grab some aquamarine as well. We might actually want to make the aquamarine seeds at this point because of how much we're using it. But let's grab that, 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 that. Um, at Astral. Let's grab our wands. Come over here. I need this. Craft, please. There goes a the slime. All right, so I'm assuming that we're, we're going to need a lot more uh, alchemical brass here because I need it again for these brass plates for the altar. And so I'm thinking if it's to make alchemical brass, it takes 10 instrument or five instrumentum. And to make instrumentum takes potentia and metallum. So if it's five per, we can do one is two and one is three. 
So if we do, where does that meet up? 12 and 24. Go for 24. Oh, that's a little much. Wait, I think it's half that. And then... That's not good. Where's my... You don't mix in here, do you? That's... Break it! Break it! <laughs> okay, that's not... We're fine. All right, I'm back. Uh, there was a little mishap. Uh, while doing, trying to create the alchemical brass, I accidentally threw in my sword. And I was like, oh, that just won't do. Let me load a backup real quick without making a backup of where I was currently at. And I saw the time on the backup file because it was like, like, oh, that was like 30 minutes. You're like, whatever, I'll, I'll redo 30 minutes of work, whatever. Not looking at the date. Oh, sorry. Uh, not looking at the date for the last backup. It was days ago. So I loaded back up and I'm like, oh, no, this can't be. It was. Uh, so I got really mad and I took a day or two of a break from recording or playing this mod pack at all because it's really, really testing me. But uh, moral of the story is I did it, I redid everything. And by redid everything, I mean I cheated it all back in because that was hours and hours and hours of work that I'm just not gonna redo. Um, so I did cheat. I did cheat back to where we were in the pack. Uh, I didn't add anything extra. I didn't do anything different. I did everything the way it was back from the phytogenic insulator, which we didn't have. Uh, lost all of our entrepeniums. I put those back the way they were, uh, the exact same way. Nothing is different. Everything is the same. And I did go ahead and make the, uh, whatchamacallit, the blood altar just to make sure I didn't make the same mistake again. Because then I would have probably imploded. Um, but that is made now. But I do have to go collect demonic wills. Uh, just because if you try and cheat the demonic will in, uh, it doesn't really have any stats on it. So I'll, I'll have to recollect those, but that's not, that's not a big, I, that's not a big problem. Um, had to recollect the star metal, all of it. Like it was... Oh, it was horrible. So I'm gonna open up all these loot boxes because we, um, these are all the loot boxes that we got from recompleting our, our all of our quests. And I'm just we didn't get we did get a, we did get this. I know we did get this premium watering can. Um, creator build of wands pretty useless. If anything's like so op that we didn't get the first time, I'm just gonna toss it out. Um, because I would say that's not really fair. Because, I mean, while we did have to, like, redo hours and hours of work, um, if anything's super OP, I kind of re-rolled for it. So, I'm just not going to... I won't I won't keep it. Um, so far, though, everything's pretty average. Because I know for a fact we did get the premium watering can and one of the... Uh, whatchamacallits. One of the loot boxes. The creative, builders, the creative Builders one is pretty useless to me, I think. Uh, let me just make sure it's not some crazy recipe, though. Yeah, no, it's it's whatever. Uh, it's useless to me. I'll keep it there anyway. Um, horn, hardened cell frame, nothing crazy. It's all pretty basic stuff. I have no idea what that is, but that can kind of replace our landing pad that we got, I think. Purple crystal shulker box? That's pretty useless to me. Um, is this... How do you craft this? Okay, so that's... That's good, but it's not overpowered, so I think we'll keep it. Um, oh, no, not that. Loot chest, come back to me. <laughs> Two, three. Uh, useless, not useless, but not great. Um, I forgot they had that. I'll keep that, it's pretty. We already have one of those, useless and useless. So, uh, nothing crazy, actually. Uh, we did get this premium back, which I'm happy about, because I actually... <laughs> Oh, <laughs> I forgot that someone comes out of that. I'm so sorry. <laughs> um, but yeah, so now we have this, which actually, hold on. Is the market hard to get? I don't think it is. No, it's super easy. Emerald, planks, cherry wood, uh, pink wool. It doesn't take a block of emerald though, so I will. No, 
Yeah, I'll, I'll throw out the emeralds, uh, just because I don't feel right about that one. Uh, who can trash his emeralds? So yeah, now we're back to where we were. Everything is as it should be. Although I will say, I did lose a lot of time because, um, I looked at our inferior medicines that were down a solid, like, 30k from where we were. But, I mean, that's fine. Um, oh, and I didn't make the drawer for it yet, either. I know for a fact I put a drawer in there. I'll have to redo that, too, and remake the, uh, upgrades for it. Alright, now it's looking nice and new. Um... Put the upgrades back in and everything, so we should be good to go. And now we are truly back where we were. I'm sure I'm forgetting something else, but uh, we have a new friend now, so that's cool. What's his name? Emerald Muncher? <laughs> Interesting. All right, I'm just trying to figure out how this <laughs> stuff works, and I'm losing... Uh... I'm losing life essence very quickly, so I think on this time make the uh, blood orb maybe. <laughs> oh, yep. Okay, cool. So now we have a blood orb in there, which is so you should store it right. So we got the blood orb. We got some blank slates. We got blood altar tier two. So we need some blank runes. So if we get some blank runes going on. Alright. <clears throat> Good thing I tested it this time. Because I don't have to keep making blood orbs. I can just use that one blood orb. And it seems like it takes. For this. To get the blank slates. It takes about a thousand. Life points or life essence for a blank slate. You need a. Uh, some of this as well. There's got to be a way to automate this. I would think. Pump it full of that. There's got to be a better way. All right, before I get into this, uh, we do have the environment controller from one of our, <clears throat> whatchamacallits, um, one of our quests here. And I'm kind of thinking if we get the power cell, get another power cell here. Um, can I craft prismary? Oh, I can. I forgot I set that up. <laughs> so we get some prismarine. Um, the power cell. Let's get the card. And then let's... I don't I don't even know, to be honest. Um, let's just set this up like here. Go home. Let's stop lagging. Link this. Go back. Put this bad boy in there, and now we should be getting a lot. Oh my god. Nope, now we're losing power. I just shot all the way up and then said, nope, I'm going to start losing power. Nope, now we're gaining it. I think it must be the steam turbine turning on and off. Anyway, so we'll slap this here. And I'm kind of concerned on a power situation. We should probably get that fixed. Um, radius of, let's just do five. Uh, can I look at where this is? We'll not get the effects. This is like a super lag interface. Um, but we will need this. Oh, what's happening? Stop. I need this and I need this. This needs a syringe. So let's grab a couple of these. One, two. Let's grab some glass here. And then make a hundred. Sure, why not? Actually, there might be a good reason as to why not, but we'll see. All right, we're about to do this in the base. Um, we need syringes for an iron golem. I'm pretty sure we need 30. Yeah, it's one, two, three. Okay. Um, where is he gonna have trouble reaching me? I'll just do it in here. Boom, 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 bam. Uh I also need I know I need okay, let's go back here for a second. Cause I know I need to analyze the golem actually. 
Thermometer. Let's use this to try and prevent that uh a weird memory leak. All right, Sir Gollum. Boom! Learn something new. Thank you. Can I do this, or do I have to? Oh, you don't care. Or do you care? Just that you can't reach me. Oh, you don't care. Interesting. But now you must die. He still doesn't care. Interesting. All right, let's try this out, shall we? We got the regeneration plus module. So if I slap that bad boy in there, I am now being blessed with the with the power here. Um, are we eating a lot of power? No, we're actually going up still. All right, so it works. So then if I just sit here, we don't have to worry about dying anymore or eating pretty much. All right, there are eight blank runes. Cool, so now we have the blood altar tier two. Let's pull out the tome here. Which one is the blood magic? You are, so the ritual master, ritual stone, face with rituals, activation, maybe not. So if we come back here, architect maybe, blood altar. Oh yeah, I forgot, there, it just didn't show up. But if I had to guess, I just have to surround this thing with the blank runes, but I'm gonna double check. All right, so my internet's been like really messed up as of late, so I have no idea if this is right or not. I'm just assuming it is. But um, we do want this, so we're gonna want a Thaumium sword. I'm not sure, do we have any Thaumium? It looks like we do not, so we need to go home. How do I make Thaumium? Precantio and Terra. So what's a good source of Precantio? I think dirt's Terra, right? Hello? Yeah, okay, so we throw some dirt in there. So the Thaumium is one dirt, Precantio. What has Precantio aspect here? The answer is Mana Steel. Mana Steel has some extra, so we'll just uh do that all right let's not throw in my sword this time i'm not even gonna look i'm not even gonna look we're just gonna oh wait i need iron we did not grab any iron let's grab a stack just for later which reminds me probably have it now um yeah we have some iron left in there oh is that thomium oh we have thomium right here don't even need to do it I'll just leave this here just in case. Um, what's another stack of iron? Who cares? Okay. So now we should have some sticks. Thaumium sword. And then if we go back to the Batania area, it's gonna take three thousand. Life essence. Are you okay? Where's my regen? There it is. There we go. And it looks like the tier two did take because it's doing something. So it means it did something right. We're almost there. Or not. Okay, there we go. The dagger of sacrifice. I did want that. So now I can do. Choose more detailed information about the blood altar. Seers are stronger, more in depth with divination sigil seed singling. Sentiments, rituals, master ritual stone. Create lava, grow crops, and damage enemies. So the damage enemies is what we want. Um, I know for a fact damage enemies is what we're gonna need. So we can make a little mob farm above this and get the blood. 
So I was looking at what we need to do the master ritual stone. We'll need ritual stones and a magician or just any kind of blood orb, I guess. Um, the ritual stone does need to print its blood orbs and reinforce slate, which just needs this. Which means I seem to keep stabbing myself multiple times. It's a good thing we got the uh, <laughs> the regeneration thing here, though. All right, so to try and um, I, what does this? Oh, let me do that. I'm gonna try and kind of automate it a little bit so I don't do too much. I'm gonna throw in our living rock, which should get inserted to here. Which, if I use this, will it stab me. No, it won't stab me. So I have to keep using this. So let's get myself down pretty low. And then this should be pulling out once it actually wants to do something. The slate. Oh, I think there's a lot more in there than I think there is. Okay. So I think it does stack. Which is interesting. I don't think I have the blood to do it. Come on, tier two. I know this is going to be my second death of the whole series. I know, I know it's going to be. We're bringing out the apples too. We got to get that gen going. Oh yeah, there we go. So it is, it's doing exactly what I wanted to do. Doing exactly what I wanted to do. Regen three. Absorption. Okay, so yeah, so it's cycling everything I want it to cycle. It's pulling out the blank slates and then recycling them in so we can get the uh, reinforced slates. Perfect. It is crazy how fast I'm getting these hearts back though. Oh yeah, we're capping it out. Speed. I also just realized I've been continually recycling the blank slates because I had the whitelist. I should have I should have pulled that out a different way. Um and I still can. I still can. This is soaking up some blood. I've been here for a couple minutes and I'm just refilling it up. I'm going to need to do something about this uh, tank, though. Only 10 buckets isn't that much. You can do it. I am making... I forgot how many orbs I'm... Or how many things I'm making. But I'm making enough to... Uh, get all the ritual stones. Alright, there we go. I saw it get pulled out. And now we have 12 reinforced. Which is very nice. So now we can make the... Let's pull out this. Let's make some of uh, this ritual stone. Not this. Just the normal ritual stone. Um, so we need the apprentice blood orb, which needs Victus crystal. Do we have any Victus? Uh, that could be a problem. Let's let's see here. Victus, I'm not seeing any red here. That's a problem. But, I mean, that makes sense. No, I need Victus, not Ignis. Okay, what? Victus, life is between Terra and Aqua. Who, what can I smelt down to make this? Um, The fruit of... Can I make this, or is that a drop from a Gaia Guardian? All right, so I was looking, and apparently saplings have Victus in them. They do. Uh, so there's a source of Victus, I guess. Uh, so let's come back into here. Let's grab some quartz crystals. Let's dump, I don't know. Let's do eight for now. Cool. Thank you. And there's 20 Victus Crystals. Very nice. We only need one, so we'll dump the rest in there. Dump that in there and uh, be good. So we come back here. We go back to our area. And I don't remember. Wait, how much did it say it needed? Um, Apprentice Blood Orb, 5,000. How much we got? 6,000. Easy. Easy. All right, here it is, our apprentice blood orb. 
And so I think now we can make the ritual stones. Um, oh, it got me that quest too. So now let's make some ritual stones, shall we? The ritual stone, Salus Mundus. Uh, I, didn't I teach my system how to make Salus Mundus? I did. I See, I knew I did it for a reason. Missing 20 flint. That's embarrassing. Hold on. All right, turns out we have no gravel, but I do know of one way to easily obtain lots of gravel, and that's going to be through the Stoneworks Factory. Doo -doo. Material Stonework Factory. Bam, bam. Can I just make one? No, of course I can't. Although it's not that big of a deal, honestly. Plastic. Make some of that. Let's get one of... What do I need? Lava and water. So if I do this and then come outside, I'll get the stonework factory done. And I'll probably honestly just make a stonework factory for stone as well. All right, now we got a, a good source of stone and gravel. It looks a little weird, but I got to tell you, I'm, I'm really getting over looks. <laughs> I'm, I'm carrying less and less as I progress in the pack. So put all that away, get our torches, and then now we can make flint, right? Why aren't you picking up the gravel? We should have... Yeah, we have gravel. I don't know what you're all mad about. But there we go. So now we don't need this. We can make some ritual stone, which I needed for Salus Mundus. Make some of that. Okay, so maybe not that much. Maybe like 20. And that should be good. All right, now we can craft it into what we need. There's that. And I'm pretty sure for our master infusion, we don't have the orb we need. We need a master blood orb, I think. Whatever the tier three blood orb is, is what we need. <laughs> it's what I'm getting at here. But we have the ritual stone, so that's good. All right, so we do need a tier three altar, which is I'm just confused as to why a tier two altar then comes to this because we need a tier three altar for the thing master, magician, archmage, master, magician, archmage. So I don't know why. I think this quest needs to be moved over to our tier three blood altar, which needs 20 blank runes and four glowstone. Uh, easy enough. I'll just I'll just do that now. I may have messed up. I inserted the whole stack. <laughs> We're going to get a whole stack of blood runes. Of blank runes, I mean. Which is, you know, a little overkill. But it's fine. Just gained a new heart, too. Yeah, I really need to get this ritual going <laughs> for, uh... Uh, what, what, whatever you call it. The, the ability to kill um, the mobs for the blood. Because this is ridiculous. Not the time it's, it's taking, just the... I have to stand here and stab myself repeatedly. I also noticed while I was standing here, sorry to keep cutting in and out, but there's just things I'm noticing. Now that I have all this time to think while I stab myself. But, um, the regen 3 is being provided by this. Uh, so, that's why I have regen 3. It has nothing to do, nothing to do with the apples or the regeneration potion I just grabbed. Uh, so don't waste those. My guy just wasted all mine. But what does help is if you eat and have saturation, then your hearts really start going up. So it looks like we're finally done, maybe? But we're still losing... Okay, there we go. Look at that. Perfect timing. Full stack of blank slates. Uh, What do we need for this? We need blank runes. I can do that. Blank rune. We need 20. Do, do just make some of these to bam let's grab some glowstone one two three four and now we can do this but hopefully my internet's back up so i can see how to build this one all right actually i've decided i'm going way too far into blood magic for no reason uh because for this elven gateway core we only or well, i guess the celestial altar we only need reinforced slate and we have that so uh, no need to go any further. 
So I won't go any further there, but we do need this arcane pedestal, which means we have to do more thumbcraft stuff. So we'll get to that um, next. Uh, on to activate, so this thing should be off now. Maybe, let's see if this goes off. Okay, so let's go home real quick. Now that we have everything we need. Um, ritual stone, living rock, don't need it, don't need it, don't need it, don't need it. Okay. Um, well, actually, let's see. We will need to make um, whatever you call it, the reinforced celestial altar. So an arcane pedestal, which means I need to get my at Thomcraft. I need this back, and then let's bust open the Thomonomicon if it's in here. I don't think it is, so we will need to go in here. Stop lagging, bust open the Thaumonomicon. Uh we that's all we got the whatever, the golem. So now we're good with that. Let's see here. Arcane Infusions probably is where it's at, if I had to guess. Not the proving stones, infusion. A feather, a file of air essence, and stone. All right, I just checked the time on the recording, and we are way over time. I mean, way over. So I don't really want to drag this uh, portal thing into another episode. So what I'm going to do is we need to get the glass files for... I don't even remember at this point. Uh, let's see. Hold on. Wait, wait. All right, I remember now. We need the vial so that we can get the file of air essence so we can unlock infusion, so we can unlock the craft that we need for one of these bad boys yeah this arcane pedestal so we can do that so i'm gonna time lapse it and then hopefully we'll be done in like a minute or two and close out the episode All right, uh, I'm calling quits. I can't do it anymore. I, <laughs> I just can't do it anymore. It's like one thing leads to another, and then you need this one certain, like the attuned rock crystal, you need this one certain thing. You have everything else, and then that one certain thing, you have to go up a whole nother tree to do, and it's just a whole lot of waiting for actual sorcery, and I'm just, I'm, uh, I'm over it. So, we're going to end the episode here after we collect all of our uh loot chests and everything at least that should put me in a better mood right just collect everything and i know i know this episode is way way over at this point but not much you can do when things just go terribly wrong <laughs> but we have all of this now which is great 
how much we want to bet that we're not going to get anything useful. And that's it. So let's open these chests and see what we got. Extreme chili, more food, bottle of enchanting. I don't, don't need it. Inventory, going to toss that. Let's get these out of here. Do, do, do. Brewing stand, useless. Weather builder, already have one. Infusion crystal, I guess. Uh, more extreme chili. Conversion kits, the energy infuser, tape measure, which I just made one of those to build the thing. More food, a scanner. Now that, that I will take. An atomic disassembler. Thank you very much. Uh, cinnamon sugar donuts and mending moss. Uh, let's toss, 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 and then probably just toss. How hard is this to craft? Oh, it's really easy to craft. I just never got around to it. Alright, that's it.